Hi, I'm Kirsty Meakin from Nail Nails, and in this video, we're gonna do another Christmas design. In this Christmas design, we are gonna do swagging tinsel and lights, just like they would be on a Christmas tree. So as you can see, I've already created an almond shape nail. I've extended it out and we've used natural beige, I think. <laughs> Only my favorite color. <laughs> so what we're gonna do now is we're gonna apply Love Spell, but we're not just gonna use Love Spell. Oh no, no, that'd be too easy. I am gonna do two coats of this color. Now this could be for an accent nail. You could do, I mean, you could do this design all over. Pop that in the lamp, give that a cure. I'm gonna seal this in with Mega Gloss. Now I need to make sure that I cap as well. Make sure I cover all of the color into the lamp. Now we have some more magic chrome powder. This is the emerald one. I'm gonna use a little brush for this. And I'm literally gonna add, oh my God, do you know what this looks like? Northern Lights. The Aurora Borealis. Yeah, it looks like Northern Lights. It's not what we're creating. I just want some of it to have this gorgeous emerald chrome in there. So I've just done the random zigzag and then some other little bits in those sections there. I love this powder, you can do so many things with it. I'm making sure I'm giving it a good rub so it goes super shiny. And then I'm gonna dust off any excess. And then I'm going to take a little bit of Mega Gloss onto some backing paper from a form. So I've literally taken off a sculpting sticker and just used that backing. And then we're gonna use the holographic chrome and we're gonna put some of that in there. So just using the cuticle, push it, and start to mix that in. We're gonna create these little swags now. That's gorgeous. You could do so many things with this, couldn't you? Love it. Pop it in the lamp, give that a cure. So that's all cured. Beautiful. You could just leave it like that. And I'm sure that'd be very nice, but no, why would we want to do that? We are going to add some lights. Do you know those old fashioned lights where it's a bulb, it's a colored bulb and they like um, they look like an egg, egg shaped clear bulb. How old are you? <laughs> Do you know where they've gone? Do you know on the way to here? Mm -hmm. There's a place and it says... Oldville. It says... Uh, no, it does not. There's a sign. Mm -hmm. It's a tree and it says 
we sell Christmas trees, yeah? yeah, he's open, yeah. And they've got these bulbs mm. hanging off them. Honest no. to God, on the way. They sell reefs as, reef, the reefs as well. Uh, they sell chicken eggs and things like that. Mm -hmm. It's a little farm, obviously. Mm -hmm. And they've got these bulbs. They're about that big. Mm -hmm. And they're old-fashioned. They look like an egg shape. And it's actually coloured glass. So it's coloured it's color glass. Mm -hmm. It's a coloured glass bulb. Dead old-fashioned. I mean, like, I don't even think my mum ever had them. So where do these guys have had them from? I don't know. <laughs> vintage. So they're she's going to make your, your nail old-fashioned now. But I think they're really nice. I do think they're really sweet. Vintage is cool. Vintage is cool. And I do think they're really sweet and it's something nice we can do. What I'm going to do, first of all, I'm going to take some of the white. So I've got a selection of paints here. I've got green, lilac, pink and orange. I've got a little bit of blue here. I'm going to mix a paler colour. So I'm going to make them all sort of a pastel colour, just so they stand out. I am going to water them down. And I'm just going to do the shape first of all. I'm going to make that a bit more pink. It looks too white. And then I'm going to make this into a wash. You know, like we did with the Christmas tree design, we made a wash to make this glow. If you haven't seen the Christmas tree design, check out the link. Put the wash on so it goes outside and inside of that little shape that we've created. And then let the brush suck it up a bit. So what happens when you do this sort of glow effect is by the time that you've rinsed your brush and dried your brush out, the edge of the paint has started to dry. So then you go in with a dry brush, which sucks it up and leaves you with an edge. I'm going to do the little, what's the little thing in the middle of the ball called? The wiry bit. The what? The wiry bit in the middle of a bulb. Filament. The filament! <laughs> Don't forget the filament! So I'm going to do this with a few different colours. So I'm going to use the orange now. The wash is going to make it transparent. Clean the brush, dry the brush, and it'll start to suck up the excess. You'll get the glow. So I'm going to carry on and do this with all the different colours. So with the white paint now, I'm just adding a dot to the tops of each of the light bulbs, and then also going round these little swags and just adding little white dots as if they are bright sparkles in that little swag. What's a swag? I oh, thought like Justin Bieber was swag. No, like when, you, when, when, it's swag. when you swag like, it's how you put things on it, like your it's swag swaggy. tinsel. Is that, is that a stalking? Your swag tinsel on you. Do you know what Never swag heard. is? Never swag. heard that before. I got swag. Swagger Jagger. Swagger Jagger. And you can have swags on your windows, can't you? That like a lot of... Or drapes. Or drapes. I don't know. Tell me I haven't got the wrong, the wrong word. You know. I'm not saying that you've got the wrong no, word. No, I mean, I tell me. I want them to tell me. On, tell me. Comment below. Yeah, comment below. Tell us if I'm swagging or I'm draping. <laughs> or, or drooping or drooping or <laughs> looping or whatever the word is so now i'm going to seal this with mega gloss and i love this because you can see that chrome in the background as well i love it it's so pretty 
Pretty fabulous. So we're going to seal that in with a nice, even, generous layer of mega gloss. Pop that in the lamp. So that's all cured now. Let's finish that with some cuticle oil. Tinsel and baubles. Not baubles. Bulb. Tinsel and bulbs. <laughs> <laughs> Such an idiot. <laughs> Tinsel and Christmas lights. That's yeah, lovely. okay. Tinsel and Christmas lights. I hope you like that design. If you like this design, give us a thumbs up. I want to see your thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe. All the products we've used today are in the description box below. Check them out. Don't forget to look at us on Facebook and Instagram. And I will see you in another video. Is it going to be a Christmas one? Maybe. Merry Christmas, guys. Happy holidays. got a pink and I think I could definitely be in Sweeney Todd cause they all sing like that I don't think you need to be a good singer I think you just could wing it you'd be alright then what do you want <laughs>